Welcome back fellow armchair generals. This is Gamer1745 here with my continuing playthrough of Railway Empire, the German um, DLC, which I'm calling the Kaiser's Reichsbahn. Playing it um, with consultations with my friend IKB, who is our railway expert. Say hi, IKB. Hello, everyone. And so you'll be hearing his voice um, input on as I play this. And of course, we're playing this live on Twitch. So if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. You can follow us over on Twitch. Now, letting everyone know our current new task is to secure access to two, two areas because sort of ultimately we are trying to unify Germany or Germany's railway. Um, I think for resources, and this is the button we need to, to be able to buy that, this both geographically and various resources, um, uh, Rhineland, yes um is where we want to move into but we don't have no money so we're going to just try to earn some money here um i think we have maxed out our um yeah we can't do any more bonds but we've maxed it out we're doing well enough and for our research well okay ikb What is what should be our important goal? Do you think for railway research? Because we have um, 120 points, we don't have to spend it right now. If we, you know, want to move to what direction? What do you think? Right. What have we got here? Um, you know, do we? Counter, what does counter pressure brakes give us? Um. That it reduces maintenance requirements. Right, be good. But you know, so we can move to other better down this path down here to um, a bogey or um, primary suspension, which helps passengers. Do we want to push towards um, standardization of components and then try to get um, increased power, or do we want to try to push for better locomotive? Well, we have to sort of do that. But we can do either, or we can push up to towards steel wheel tires, or train instructions. What do you think's worth it? Um, what have we got in the um in the other tab of the ah, yes. tech tree? Okay, we can um get more uh, mail package deliveries. Go that direction, or um. In, uh, waiting times increased for um, willingness for passengers or better um, recruiting applicants right now which pushes us down towards now this is a, what I normally often do is things that will increase your like innovation gain might as well get that faster to then get other things unlocked faster instead of wait but we could push in that direction or up here so I don't know what do you think we should go as a goal what what path i think you should push for fast more innovation points to unlock more. okay so yeah you're agreeing with me that that's a good good thing so we'll do yeah. that so so we first one is get more applicants here so sponsors we'll do that ah uh, just forgot natural and that we're um auto corrected that from oh Remington cartridge for natural. Remington cartridge that is natural of the beast. Okay, the, oh, the nature of the beast, right. So we're gonna let the time go. Okay, well, now we have um, Station Master. Uh, I'm not gonna spend the money on an analyst or a reporter. So we're generating it now. Um, why are we stopped? Okay, this guy is probably what's stopping us. Okay, he doesn't have enough. I'd rather have him run empty than block things. Uh, 
Oh, conductor. Well, it'll probably be beneficial overall. Um, Oh, hang on everybody. I want to tab over and look at something for a moment. Um, we had a question, I think it was. Um, Armchair General says, feel the sound. Um, no, it's on, must be on the Civil War episode. Another well, railway question. That. I think. Okay, um, not that you have to know this but you're the best one to know this ikb this is a question from jeff viewer longtime viewer in australia um here's a question has the u.s rail converted um to concrete sleepers or a mixture of timber and concrete my answer was um um the system is patchwork nationwide and i think it's a mix but do you know anything on that not that you you know look bad if you don't i just thought that you might have an idea on that IKB? Um, from what I've seen in America, there's a mix of both, as there is in the UK and I think most other places. Yeah, I recently saw, I mean, just within the last week or so, um, saw a little video, little clip of a video of a sort of like a digger type machine that would um, specifically designed to, to pull out the wooden sleeper and put in a concrete one in a semi-automated type um, method and while leaving the rail system in place. Obviously, you can't run trains on it while this thing is sitting on the railroad, but you don't have to pull up the whole thing and replace it. So I don't know if you guys are using anything like that, but I definitely saw some video of, of that an operation. Uh, we, don't, we, don't, we don't get to play with anything quite that fancy, but we... Um... I mean, it may have been a prototype thing we that I was still, I was watching, and you know, I don't know. We we still change sleepers the uh, mostly the old fashioned way by hand. Right. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure that's tough work. Which actually leads actually leads to wood ones being preferable because concrete sleepers are really heavy, as in you need about six to eight men to pick one up. Okay. That would be yeah. Whereas wooden ones, you can get away with about four. Right. Okay. That that that's a good point because this this was a not a huge tractor thing. It was you know, fairly small, but it was you know it had a um they they showed it that it would sort of go in and, and set up and it sort of vibrate and um, dig out the the earth around it, pull out extract to the side um you know the the wooden one, pick up from a pile the concrete one, slide it underneath there, and then sort of draw it up and then hold it there while some people would you know fill the earth in around it kind of thing. And so that that was a you know somewhat automated. I mean, I, I think there's people involved. It's not like a robot without humans, but it was mechanized, shall we say? And I didn't know if this was common or it may have been a, just an experimental type setup. But humans' ability to manu maneuver things like you know railway um, sleepers and other things um, is a real factor that people often forget. I wasn't even thinking of those. Okay, we probably need some more signals on this line. Okay, pause that. Let's see. We're getting a lot of stops here that I think might. I'm little concerned about just introducing more trains to this line without 
capacity. I'm sort of watching that potato farm there. Okay, now that we got another one, we can do innovation points. So 10% more. Here they're waiting. So. There we go, that got them freed up. Which frees up other things. Okay, JP, see you tomorrow. Let's speed this up because just right now time. Okay, I want to get to 400,000 because we're gonna that'll leave us 200,000 to build something with. So that's not. Hopefully, we can connect that. Okay. Um. Yeah, we'll we'll bid on that. Hey, thanks for hosting, Arna. Very good. Improved our trains. Okay, there we go. Let's let's try to purchase this. Okay. So now we've bribed them enough to get in there. Now we don't have much money. Well, it's just not going to fit well, so I think we're going to go with a standard train station here. Okay. Railway engineer here. Before we do this, let's let's get out of the well, let's let's come to the track layout here. Okay, how do we connect up coal blends? IKB we can try to cr build a bridge across here, which is going to be expensive. Come over here and connect to here, or you know, somewhere in here. We could do that. We could come down here and try to come along the edge here or something and try to connect to this railway station and expand that as a method into here. Try to tunnel, which would be god awfully expensive. I think you'd be your best option would be to go south towards um Halbert Hollow. 
Okay, that is help back to Hollywood. yeah, that is what my my th original thought. Then I saw this big mountain away because I wanted to sort of come right through there. But I think we can do there and loop around. If okay. you stay right on the edge of the river, yeah, you might be able to get away without needing any tunnels or anything. Yeah. Okay. So let's see. We're going to um, come here and we're going to expand this station. That'll be the cheapest way of doing that. Okay, and that will get us to um, temporarily place that there, and then we're going to delete that, do that, and we're going to delete this, yeah, because we get it back. There we go. So that gets us that. Now, that, we still have, I think, enough money to at least get the train station built. Hmm. Let's drop that there. Now let's see if we can improve this. There we go. There we go. Hmm. I don't even want that amount of bridging if I can help it. You know we're gonna have to carve more out of the mountain next time. Okay, not too steep. Not too twisty. I think do we yeah I think that's the best okay so let's no we don't have no money okay almost but we'll wait okay well we got that started at least excellent now, you should make a profit to make up for the cost of your investments. Right, okay, so... Oh, we already had one area, I guess that counts as to Chief Engineer. Um, yeah, we'll... We'll do that. So, goals, tasks. Um, own two industrial businesses and rural businesses. Okay, got one, so we just need to get one more. Achieve a quarterly revenue of... Uh, 200,000, boost the area of Hesse to 240,000 inhabitants, produce 60 loads of cloth, secure access to six areas, that's a long ways. Okay, so this is sort of really unified because we can see here a lot of areas that we'll need to get access to. Okay, so those are long-term goals. Okay, and now we've earned enough money um, to go back here, purchase that. I'm absolutely sure that building that bridge would have been costly going across. Not sure how much more. Okay, so as soon as we get a bit more, we'll add the second. And we'll probably have to wait on. Well, we can do that and do that. Okay. There we go. Now, these are free, but we, all, we need to make sure to tell it 
to go in that direction there. Keep that flowing. And... Oh. Gotta do a crossover up here. Well, or crossing points. So we'll wait a little. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Okay. There we go. Go in that direction. You guys come in this direction. Yeah, we'll add a few more eventually. There we go. Now, train. Railway line. We're going to go from here. To here, to here, back to here. Okay. Um, yeah. And, um, hmm. Well, we don't have enough for that, but we don't even want that. Um, yeah, let's grab this. It's faster. A Waverly. Imported from Britain, I'm presuming. And now we have enough money for another train. We're going to go here to here to here back to here. See how that runs. Part of the reason I'm specifying here is that if we don't have a full train, when they start out, they're often full, but we can notice a lot of these that are moving not full. If they're going through here, I'm hoping they'll pick up wheat as needed for each of the destinations. And we also grab another Waverly for that. Okay, and we're going to increase. Well, we will need to put a... Well, we've got the money for it. Um, yeah, we'll just, I think, right in there, maybe. You might need to put a... Um, it's a supply tower between uh, the new line, yep. Yeah. Yeah, we we got one there. Right. That. Hopefully that'll get these guys started. This is looking like it needs to grow here. Yeah, we don't quite have enough, but we'll... That's holding up everything. Okay, well... Um, let's see, well... Okay, you're, you're waiting there. I want to clear this junction back here without tying anything up. We want the train to be able to flow this way if they can. Yeah, you're moving a bit further forward.
Okay, yes, expand the station now. Which means that what we can do is starting here. come in and remove that. Oh, hell, it thinks it's in use somehow. Oh, well, we don't even, well, we hardly have any. Now, can I do it? Now, why is it? Damn. Um, if you go into um, if you go into the signals mode, you should be able to delete it then. No, well, yeah, uh, I can be, but it, if it, if it if it's sort of in use, meaning that I've tried to put this one here to to have the train come and, and use this signal, but if it's in use, it won't let me delete it. Meaning, if there's a train kind of thing like it, like this one, waiting to come through here, once I've done it in signals mode. On one of my games, where oh, okay. even though it said it was in use when I tried the bulldoze, I tried it in signals mode and it I was able to delete okay. it then. Yeah, well, we got that then, but okay, so go into that. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, wrong one, trash that right here, no. right about like that. I'm leaving these stubbed because if I feel that I want to later on increase the number width of, of train lines, it'll be easier to do so. Now here, um, no, 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 that's, yeah, oh, oh, almost there we go. Now here again, we will... There we go. Now we want to come back to here and well, I think we'll just, uh, there we go. Now that gets this side now here. Now, okay, they're going too far. Let's, they just come to here. So we're going to switch them to this unused track currently and that's good right they're going to here I'll switch to that track so some of the, at least two of the non through trains are now going to use the outside track um, where do these guys go okay also here so um, Let's use that track next time or whatever. It's too late this time, of course, but. Okay, now these guys, they make s sausages and boots from pigs. So we need to probably get across that river. But over here, um, what is this, hops? Um, yes, hops. And we have a... Um, Food into okay now there you just they need salt okay so they need salt which is also here I think is this is salt feldspar no that isn't salt
do we have salt anywhere on our current? Mm, I'm not seeing it. Okay. Hmm, okay. Gotta be somewhere on the map if they need it. Um, but maybe from way far away? Oh, over here at least, okay. There is salt there, but they don't need that yet. These guys are getting their... Um, potatoes already, that's sort of what we wanted to deal with. Okay, so they want... And they want pigs. There are pigs there. So we need to see what we can do for stations, even though we might not have um, Okay, well. I think that may be the ticket once we get the money for it. Okay. Well, we're going to have to wait on that a little bit, I think. Earn some more rice marks. Ah, and okay. We've got innovation points increased. Let's think. What would you like to see, IKB? Standardization of components or what? Yeah, um, standardization of components is always good. Right. Reduces the price of new locomotives by 30%. Okay. We'll wait. We're Yeah, we're... that sounds very good. Yeah. Um so we'll wait yeah. to get the more points to get that and while we're at it let's see let's hire an engineer stoker we have that okay professor um no don't need to spend the points on that okay and so let's grab some of um here and let's Fill out that train a bit better. Oh no, it didn't. There we go. And they like each other, so they'll work well together. And we have a random breakdown, but that reminds me. Let's add a maintenance shed to there. Okay, now we're down to 92. Um, We're going to shift over to that track next time. Um, oh no, uh, you have to pay to get access rights into the other German states. Yes. Yeah, that's. I think that's what you're asking. Yeah. Um, it's sort of pay slash bribe different regions to allow us in because you remember at this time we're looking at um i think i hope we'll have more um events i presume as we're working on not only rail wise connecting um the german states is we're forming you know what becomes the german empire it's still the princely states this is rhineland we are in um hess so you know up here to hanover these are all sort of independently governed and we need to convince them that we are the ones um, to do it best to um, to do the rails and by convince them meaning pay them money. Oh, they have a German castle here. How interesting. Okay. I once took a um, Rhine River cruise in which you on a boat you know, with a bunch of other tourists and go along the Rhine River and took a bunch of pictures of castles from the river. You know, other nations, um, you know, 
No, well, um, this is just, you can see on the, the map down here, um, all of those um, dots are cities that we can connect. And white ones have nobody connected there. We're the purple, um, the yellow and orange. We can connect to those other cities. There can theoretically can be more than one train station, depending on various conditions and things. So that, but off, off this map, no, we can't. We already have a chief engineer. Um, yes, yeah, so this is going to be any better. No. So, no, thank you. Somebody else can hire you. Oh, somebody has a connection bonus. Okay. Sarbuchen wants to be connected to the railway now. Okay, let's look at this map. Ooh, that's rough terrain. Um, Come on down here. Oh, there we go. There we go. So it's pretty rough terrain in here. So that will help me figure out what to do. So we want to come from there, presumably down this valley, and connect into this with a one thing going that way and one thing going here. This is going to become a major railway situation station there okay so that's what we're gonna do how much are they offering ooh a million okay so let's see about this um i like the new control signaling system if we can get it okay now before we just decide to go with that let's zoom out and see well, I don't even know if I want to pay the extra for the... No, I don't want to pay the extra for this um, 20000 because we're only going to have... Coming from here to here, um, this is sort of the edge of... We might swing around here one day, but this is sort of going to be the edge of the... Um, yeah? Maybe you should build a um, terminal station in Starbucks since there's no, you know, no, no cities you can connect to at the other side of it. Right. Mm -hmm. I understand. Um, it just the terminal, um, large station. I don't know. Um, I don't know. Does this? Hmm. Well, I don't know that it grants us anything more than looking pretty. I don't know that I want to do that. Not really sure the use for this, quite other other than just cosmetic. Because if we don't do the terminal station, um, we can um, put this here, and then have the the trains come here on come into the back side of this station. Maybe I'm not sure that I want to do that by any means. Um, just not sure exactly how I want to connect these up yet. If we get a big enough station, we can, you know, do do that. Have them both feed into there. So I think we're going. I think we're going to just stick with a train station for the moment. Um, yeah, a good idea. But I think we're going to do this. So now.
Hmm. Biggest problem I'm seeing now, if we need to expand this station, it's going to... Gonna get in the way, but I think I think we'll do it. Okay, that got us. Not full payback by any means, but enough that it makes building this a lot cheaper. There we go. Now let's. Getting these points. There we go. Now, what we want to do is come over. Here and do that. Okay, don't enter unless it's clear. Yeah, don't don't enter unless it's clear. That's a potential little traffic problem, but not too bad, I hope. Okay, so now we have enough to add some trains. And we'll run a Waverly. And we'll do another one from here. Um, I don't need to, well... Okay, what we're going to see about doing here is making sure that they go on the correct track so that we are not jamming up too much traffic there. Yeah, you're waiting for that track to clear, of course. And let's see if we can handle it. We're going to do, oh. oh. It looks like Arno wants to do a uh, ride along and on the trains again. Oh, certainly. We'll see about coming out of here once we can, or once we get this uh, set up. And then back to here. Okay, and here, again, let's try this track, this track, and Frankfurt on Man, which is pretty busy. Yeah, that should be okay, because we haven't connected to that and not that we're going to get a lot of okay this map hello airy yes um there may be a little bit of well, let's see do we have anything like burn um innsbruck well that's austria salzburg so no no switzerland um, oh, no, Zurich. Yes, we have Zurich and Basel. Oh, so we do have Switzerland. Zurich, Basel, those are both in Switzerland. I do know my geography well enough to know that. Innsbruck, uh, or Salzburg. So, yeah, um, don't know what Klangenfurt, don't really know Klangenfurt, but Innsbruck is in Austria, at least modern day Austria, and depends on whenever. So, Basel. So yeah, so it does include down to Switzerland and all that region. So we are trying to unify as much as we can. Okay, so we've got all of these. Um, I think we're going to wait for the third train and go to Frankfurt and see how that ride is. Did we get a train for this? Yes, okay. Oh, and before, before Arno warns me um, let's do it somewhere sort of flat so you're not stopping on too steep of a grade 
And we'll also add in a few signals here just to keep things flowing a little better. Yeah, that looks good. Yes, yes, you're waiting for the track to clear. And Okay, but what we're going to do first is end the episode, not the live stream. Nobody go anywhere unless you have to. We're going to keep playing, um, but we're going to end this um, episode. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Thanks for liking the videos. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. And, of course, I'd love to hear from you. If you have a question for me or a question for IKB, a railway in-house railway expert, um, please post them below, and we'll try to get to them next time we make some episodes of this. Thanks so much. See you next time for more historical gaming.